water the cows and I'm going to show you how hot and dry it is in this part of the country. Don't let oak run long, it's just too hot. You can see that Johnson grass looks pretty good, but Johnson grass is a different animal. If you'll look, we do have some clouds with some purple bottoms. That is different, and there looks like a bank back in the northwest there. And now you can look and see how bad this stuff is looking. There's supposed to be Bermuda grass, and if you look, it's down there. But it is sure sad. We had planned to mail this. But at this point, it's nothing but stem. Hawk is still trotting right along with me. He likes to try to grab the grasshoppers in his mouth. I think he's spit them out pretty good. You can see how bad that looks. gathering around. Now we planted all of this with a no-till back in the spring with sorghum. And we got a little stand, but not much. It, if we'd have had a rain earlier, a month or so ago, it would have done better. Cows are sitting there waiting on me. They've got water. I'll pull up here and put Hawk in the shade. He'll appreciate that. There's nearly all of the Herefords right there. There's one baby. That's Abigail's baby. That's Martha's baby. And that is Diamond's baby. And of course, right there is Rufus, the daddy. I'll cut this off so I can get their water going. There are three of the calves right here. The one on the right there is a little heifer. She's the youngest one of the bunch. This is the only bull calf we've had so far. He is at a diamond. Diamond's right here somewhere. And here's the only one we've got out of the Angus. Let me see, yeah, that's his mama right there, number 23. I mean her, she's a heifer. We've got four heifers. There's another heifer way on the far side over there. That is Abigail's. This one is Martha's. This one is Diamond's. That one's number 23's, baby. We've got another in here somewhere. It's in the shade. I'll see if I can pick it up later. There's three of those babies together. That dark red one there in the middle is the one that was over across over there a little bit ago. You can see I've got one water trough full. I'm filling up number two, and then I will fill up number three when I get back. But Hawk and I will take a ride, and I'm gonna see if I can See if I can spot that other baby. All those babies have names. That black one's name is Candy. I know that. I can remember it. It's different. There's that other baby. 
That is Dixie's baby way out there by itself. I'm going to drive around this the other way. You can see how curled up and that littler grass is blue stem. And we could still make some grass if it would just rain. And we planted half of this field in sorghum like this right here. Then, right up here, we planted millet. First time we'd ever planted millet. But starting right here, see that's the last of the sorghum right there. And from there over, it was supposed to be millet. Now there is some, I see it out there, three or four stalks. We just did not get the rain that would bring that up. Show you our yard chickens. I don't see Mr. Tom Turkey. There he is. He's down there wondering what I'm doing. These are our yard chickens, all laying hens. There's a couple of roosters in there somewhere. Yeah, there's one right there. This is where they stay during this heat up here. Here comes Tom a wobbling up here with the other rooster, with the one of the roosters. That may be the only rooster in there. I'm not sure. But here comes Tom. He, you can see all the white feathers. He's been molting until he doesn't hardly have any tail feathers. But when he does and when he's a strutting, he is a handsome dude. show you the hens after I did a look at all the steers. Here they all are. This is where they spend the afternoon. And you can see those two. The one that the feathers down there is a bull. That's after. Everything else is steers. That's, your, that's a Bermuda patch. It's supposed to be Bermuda. It is when it rains. Go back now and check the water. 